What is emphasized about the physical presence of the individual when taking acknowledgments or affidavits according to the professional conduct section? Well, let's have a look at that professional conduct section of the Notary Public License Law booklet. And it states here, the practice of taking acknowledgments and affidavits over the telephone or otherwise without the actual personal appearance of the individual making the acknowledgement or affidavit before the officiating notary is illegal. And the paragraph goes on to underscore this. The attention of all notaries public is called to the following judicial declarations concerning such misconduct. The court again wishes to express its condemnation of the acts of notaries taking acknowledgments or affidavits without the presence of the party whose acknowledgement is taken for the affiant, and that it will treat serious professional misconduct the act of any notary thus violating his duty. So with this in mind, let's have a look at the four choices to determine the solution. Choice A states, it's optional if the individual's identity can be verified through digital means. Well, this does not align with what we just read from, from the professional conduct section, and therefore choice A is not the correct solution. Choice B states, it's necessary only for documents related to real estate transactions. The law does not state that. It states it uncategorically that it is regardless of whether or not the documents are relating to real estate transactions, and therefore choice B is not our solution either. Choice C states, it's a non-negotiable aspect of a notary's duties for all acknowledgements or affidavits. Well, this aligns with what we read from before, but before we mark this as the correct solution, let's have a look at choice D just to be certain. Choice D states, it can be waived if the individual is known personally to the notary public. The law that we just read from in the professional conduct does not allow for this proviso. Therefore, choice D is also not our solution, which indeed leaves choice C. It's a non-negotiable aspect of a notary's duties for all acknowledgments or affidavits as the correct solution.